here we are going to see a new operation called difference of sets well we know about difference of numbers right like 5 minus 3 now we are going to learn an operation which is like a minus b for sets how can that apply well it's something similar to differences in numbers right so just like we remove something in numbers a minus b when you have sets a and b is defined as the set of all elements in a but not in b that means you take the elements in a and remove the elements in b which is why the definition of difference right so let's see this with an example so let's say set a is a b let's say e and h okay and set b is equal to b c d f g h and let's say the universal set i'll tell you why we need this is the set a b c d e f g h okay let's find a minus b so a minus b is the set of elements in a but not in b what is in a but not in b small a is there but not here so you can include small b is there so we can't include small e is here but not here so we can include h is here but is also here so we can't include so a minus b is simply the set that contains elements a and e now when you are doing algebra of sets and if you want to simplify how do we simplify a minus b well we are going to now show that a minus b is nothing but a intersection b bar okay and again we are, we are going to prove it just with this example but since it's general you can take this as a general result right now let's look at what happens when you do a intersection b bar for that we need b bar now b is the set if u is the universal set you can write b bar is the elements not in b but in the universal set universal set is a to h all letters here so a will be there e will be there because b c d f g h are here okay now a intersection b bar is this set a b e h intersection a e and therefore that will be a e and which is why you have a minus b is a intersection b bar of course this is not a rigorous proof this is just an example but we can also show it using venn diagram and see that and that's a more general proof that both these regions will be exactly the same another idea related to difference is what is known as symmetric difference of sets okay and this is denoted by the symbol a delta b okay now a delta b contains what elements it contains set of all elements in a or in b but not both okay that means you can have elements in a or b but not both so this is effectively the set a union b minus the set a intersection b okay that means in venn diagram form you will have this is a and this is b okay a delta b will have this region and this region means this part is not included now algebraically can we simplify this slightly more well we can because we just saw the definition of a minus b is a intersection b bar so 
if we take a union b minus a intersection b we can just apply this definition so we can write a delta b is a union b minus a intersection b which is if you apply this definition it is the first one intersection second one complement so it's a union b intersection a intersection b complement now the second part we can simplify using de morgan's laws so you get a union b intersection a intersection b complement can be written as a complement union b complement so now we have a union b intersection a complement union b complement now we will have to apply distributive law twice right because we know some c intersection this will be c intersection this union c intersection the second part so i am going to keep a union b as it is so it's a union b intersection a complement okay union a union b intersection b see just think of this as c intersection uh, some d union e okay so this will be c intersection d this is distributive law union c intersection e now instead of c we have a union b instead of d we have a complement instead of e we have b complement that's all we have done okay it looks a little messy but again here we have to apply distributive law we can just reverse the order because commutative law is true so this you can write it as a complement intersection a union a complement intersection b union here it will be a uh, sorry this is not a union b intersection b complement this should be so a intersection b complement because this is b complement and union b intersection b complement so what you will find is that a complement intersection a will just become null b complement intersection b will become null and what you will have is a complement intersection b and a intersection b complement union null will not change the answer so it will simply be the union of these two sets which is a complement intersection b union a intersection b complement okay this is the simplification for the symmetric difference we can write this or we can write this or we can simply use the symbol a delta b all of these will give us the same answer